All right, FA's book club is now in session. <laughs> We're open for questions. Epe, are you more proud of the book club successes this year or the you know, getting to 50 wins as a team and, and the improvements you've made, I guess, uh, in, the, in the season? All of the above. <laughs> I'll take that one. 50 wins is special, um, especially, you know, with the West and how we started our season and how we were able to finish it. That, 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 was, that was very special. And then Epe's book club just went along with it. They had a 50-win season, too. <laughs> Was able to, you know, have tough conversations, um, grow communities as well. So that was that was great. You've been around the league for a while. Can you explain how what looked like a competitive series got off to such a poor start and wasn't competitive in the first two games? And then when a lot of teams would have just folded up, they, you know, you guys fought back, and the last three games were competitive. It seems completely right. I mean, that was tough to watch. The first two games was, was, were tough to watch. Um, especially being the NBA playoffs. Um, and the, I think, and the onus for that, I think, is just on, on us players. Uh, we we, we should have been, should have been ready to go. Uh, but, you know, it happened. Game three, we were, we came and, 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 and gave that effort. We competed. Um, game four, we did the same thing. We were able to get a win. Um, then last night, we had our chance. Just wish we would have had that juice, that competitive, you know, fire game one. Is there, is there any reason why it, that you can point to why that didn't happen? Why it, why it took? I, I have no clue. Um, I, I, I don't know. Just some, you know, the, the, we all have to look in the mirror and and come up with something. But I. <coughs> You you can fit you felt it in game three back at home like man now the series here's the series we've all been waiting for um, the first two games we just didn't give that. Epi, what's your return to the NBA been like for the last two years? First of all, being in Salt Lake, and then what indication do you have on what your future looks like either here or elsewhere in the NBA this off season? Oh, uh, I have no indications. Um, just just reflecting on the season. Um, but the two years have been good. Um, you know. Didn't get the opportunities out, you know, that I wanted, but I was with a great team, a great, a great organization. Um, I was able to build relationships that would last for a lifetime. Um, so just continue to push that um, and continue to get better and, and see what happens this summer. Hey, Pat, you're, you're a historical guy, man. You know, read a lot of books, as you, you know. Um, just being a part of this year, man, not only just basketball, with everything that happened off the court, how unique was this, this time, man, being in the midst of it? You know, being able to have tough conversations and did you anticipate something like that happening there? Um, no, I, I, you know, with the book club, I didn't think it would get to this point. Um, but then, but then the incident that happened at the arena, I think, just pushed everything forward, put it out there on the front, and then um, the conversation with Kyle, and then his piece he wrote. I think it just it's going to, it's going to continue the conversation, and people are going to have to look in the mirror and then hold, hold themselves accountable, and then hold their their circle accountable. If you know, if that's you know, you want the that conversation to go forward and, and actually present itself. Uh, you've been with a few different t teams over the years. What do you see uh, with this team going forward? What needs to be done, maybe to make and improve and get to an, uh, an, uh, the next level. Well, what do you think, sir, before I answer this question? What's your take? <laughs> I'm asking you, uh, but I, 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 I don't, I, I'm gonna give you an answer, I but you know, I'd like to hear what you have to say, better, sir. Uh, better players, uh, you know, I'm gonna be part of it. Better players, I mean, yeah, we all need them. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we, you know, for folks that, have, the, the players who are coming back that really have a good summer. Um, and I'm, I'm confident they will. Um, Donovan to go have a good summer, compete, get better, better shape. Um, Royce to continue with you know with the confidence, working on his playmaking skills. Um, and then you know playmakers, you need guys who will make plays, um, and just who are going to have that grit. What are you reading right now, Epe? I actually, well, I'm reading 
American Coddling. Just started that book. The book club is taking a break. I'm going to go, you know, let my dogs out and relax for a little bit and then get back to it. Yeah. Thank y'all for the season. Have a good one.